Today I want to show you these interactive worksheets I have created using Google Slides, 18 in total. Students practice counting from 1 to 100. Interactive because either there's a text box that appears or students can drag objects. So in this example, they look and see that there are three objects. They click on the space provided and a text box appears. Whereas in this example, they take the number and they drag it up into place. So let me show you some of the other examples. Here there are some fish. They count them, they click on the box, type in the number. Or they fill in the missing number. So starting with easy, one, two, three, four, five, and they would type in the number five in there. Or counting by tens. Or these ones are random starts, 30s, the 40s on the next sheet, the 70s, the 80s, the 90s. And here they would look at the two numbers, 8 and 12, which one's greater? And they just slide the check mark beside the one that they feel is bigger. Oh, the next one is put the check mark where the number is smaller. So in this case, I would put the check mark here. Lots of examples then with gumballs. So in this one, I've given some numbers, which is the greatest. They would find the one that's the greatest and type the number in the correct box. Here's an example using a gumball machine. How many yellow? So they go up there and count and fill in the numbers and so on. Here they can pick some fruit, add it to the basket, and then do some counting. How many apples? How many bananas? Same with the fish. This one they get to design their own goldfish bowl and then I ask questions about counting. Here's another gumball example. What number is missing? 10, 11, 12 and they would just take the number and slide it into place. Here's one with birds on a wire and notice they have numbers on their little bellies and again they can drag birds around and um, answer some questions. Who doesn't like ice cream? So of course I did one example with ice cream and then the students can count by twos and fives. And one with fish where they can add the fish to the buckets and again practice their counting by twos, by fives and by tens. Your students are going to love it. Thanks for stopping by to take a look.